This is Mrs. Wilkoskis in the library. It is um, January 12, 2017, and this video is on finding images for your Greek mythology project um, on the open web. Okay, I really encourage you to use ArtStore. The images are much higher quality. You can verify that they are what you think they are without a lot of searching, and that's on another video in this little playlist here. But I'm going to show you, I've got a link to some Greek museums. And basically, you would just go through each different. You, I cannot find any museum search engine that'll allow you to search the holdings at various museums through one search engine. It's like every time you have to go out and search the museums yourself. And you know, if you you know the names of something like Smithsonian and Metropolitan Museum of Art or whatever. However, when I was searching for images, I'm finding stuff in stuff in you know the Tucson Museum or I would have never known the name of the Athens Agora Museum or the Delos Museum if I'm even pronouncing that correctly. So I wanted to show you how I went about looking for some um, images. So you can start with this and you're certainly going to have some because this is a bunch of Greek, uh, museums in Greece. But let me show you what I did. So I, I just typed in Zeus, okay? And this is what you see. And it doesn't matter if you use Zeus or a lesser god, it, you're still going to see a lot of this cartoonish stuff. So I, I did Zeus and I did image search, okay? You're going to find a lot of cartoonish stuff, okay? And I want to get rid of that. So I figured out a way to kind of get rid of it. Doesn't, doesn't, it's not going to find everything, but I go into my advanced settings. And I, I did two different searches. One is add museum here. And when I add museum here, it's looking for Zeus and museum in the descriptors, okay, which is, you know, if it's in a museum and your image has to be in a museum, hopefully be posted that it's in one of the, it will be posted in the descriptor that it's in a museum. So I, once I did this and I hit search, I get a much higher quality image uh, search results. You can see this, okay? Now you still see this is Pinterest, okay? Actually, I follow these links. These are usually pretty good, but people will post, and this might be on someone's Pinterest board, and this might call it Zeus, but it may not be in Zeus. But if you follow the link, it'll tell you what um, museum it's in, and you will need to, like, here's a good example, okay? Because I've already actually done this one already. So this one right here. Okay, I visited the page because you want to see what museum it's in because that's how you're going to cite it. Okay, and it says it's in the Athens National Archaeological Museum. Okay, so I actually went out to this museum's website and verified that it's in that museum. And that's what you're trying to do. You need to verify it is actually a statue of Zeus and you need to verify that it's in a museum. And that's one of the ways you can do that. The other way, the other search I did, again, if you find what you need here, you don't have to keep going, but down here, I'm going to get rid of this. I started off doing this by doing .org or .edu because all your university museums would end in .edu. Those are the ones in the United States. All the regular museums would end in .org. Okay. Um, however, I was still getting, I'll show you. I'm still getting a lot of stuff that that means that's not what I need. So I'll show you what I did. So I'm going to go back into my advanced settings and I type the word museum in here. Museum. I'm spelling it wrong. And now it's looking for the word museum in the URL. So let me show you what that's going to look like. It's still going to miss a lot of museums. You know, um, I think the Metropolitan Museum of Art does not have museum in its URL, but most of your university museums do. You can see them right there as you as you click through. You've got museum in the URL, so you're finding images that are in museums. Okay, uh, you can scroll down. You're not going to find everything, so if you still need help, come by the library. I'd be happy to help you. But what you might actually have to do is literally Google, you know, uh, names of museums. And I pick the biggest museums first. You could probably get a list of museums and just start clicking through and, and searching the museum holdings, which is really not very hard. But um, I'm hoping that I just made it easy enough that you won't have a lot of struggle. Come and see me in the library if you have any more questions or if you still need help finding images.